how to upload digital products to Shopify. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you a method on how you can upload and make sales and sell a lot of digital products on Shopify. It is very simple. This is very uh, easy to do. All you have to do is to set up your Shopify account. Then you have to choose a plan. Then of course you have to put a digital product. In my case, I have here a digital product called Canva Summer Template. I will show you how I can configure this to be a digital product. All you have to do is to go to your home section. Then on the search bar, you have to type digital downloads like this. And all you have to do is you go to the Shopify app store. Right now we are on the Shopify app store and as you can see right here, this is the app that I am going to use. Now we have it for free because the developer of this app is Shopify itself. I am going to install it. I have faith in this app and now it will be installing. Right now I am going to permit it to install and we can see it on the left side of this sidebar. It will be an app. Right here, as you can see here, these are the products I am going to put right here. Now, let's go ahead and create a product from scratch. Click on products and right now I am going to add a product. Let's go ahead and make whatever we have. Now, make sure that shipping is not something uh, checked. I am going to put, for example, Canva, Canva templates templates like this or free Canva templates. I am going to put the description uh, like this. I'm going to generate it uh, like this. Uh, here we are going to put these, uh, these templates. I am going to put this description right now. I'm going to upload a file for uh, that has the, um, of course, the uh, logo and the pricing also the for example the title of it uh, three best canva summer templates I'm going to open canva.com canva and then I will see and create for example let's go ahead and create a template let's go and put for example let's go with this this I will add for example this template I will add another page I will change the color of it for example to this orange then I will go ahead to add some elements it doesn't matter the elements that you are going to add it is up to you now for example I can add some graphics these are some graphics effects that you can add these for example that and let's go with this also here we have this now we are good to go we can add an a picture for example let's go ahead and add a picture like this this is a logo and we have this this and this I'm going to change the color of this page to for example this I am going to add some elements uh, here we have to add this I'm going to use some graphics like that and I will make it look good. The recommendation, we have the magic recommendation. For example, I'm going to put this right here. This block knot, block knots right here. We have these, this calendar, and we are good to go. This is, let's suppose that this is a uh, file or a digital template. I am going to download, for example, uh, the files let's go ahead and download the second one each one uh, individually because they are uh, if I download them for the three it will be a uh, zip file I'm going to download the third one and check these and we are good to go right here we have everything downloaded now for the magic trick all you have to do is to put right here the link that you have right now and I'm going to put the anyone with the link right here. They can edit, copy the link. Then I will go ahead with this, for example, like this. Uh, I will go here 
click here, for example, here, here to modify, like this, and we are good to go. Now I am going to put this button clickable, then I will click the link, put the link on this, click on done, done again, and then I will select all of these three images, I will download them as a PDF standard, I will download them as a PDF, then I will go back to my store, I will upload the photos that I have, here we have the photo, I'm going to wait for it, and here we have to set the price, for example, let's put it $19.99, here I am going to download the other, the, the second image, let's go to download the second image because I didn't find it, PNG, I will go to add another photo, let's go ahead and add another photo which is this, this is the second template, right here it is uploading, I will let it upload and upload finally the third design, as you can see these are the presentation of the uh, digital product, now we have set the price, the quantity you can put 999, this is uh, for you, the variation you can put a variation if you have, and the trick right here is to click on save. This is the trick that you have to put. Now, for here we have this, everything is in order, like this, 19, 19.99, SKU, like this, and right here it is uh, going to track the quantity, I will click on save, so everything will go in order correctly, you click on more actions. Right here, when you click on more actions, as you can see, add digital file. This is the option that I am going to put. Right here we have the digital file, to create a digital download, digital add a digital file to any product variant. Now I am going to add the PDF file, uh, right here, and we are good to go. As you can see right here, it is put in the PDF, and it will be... Uh, uh, Right here we have the link that I have put, as you can see right now I will show you the PDF file, where is the downloads, right here the downloads, this is the PDF file, I am going to for example when they receive this PDF file, they will be guided to the website of Canva to edit these, click here to modify, when they click on this link they can modify these three templates that I have set so on their Canva template, and that was very simple, it is uh, still uploading, now it has finished the upload, all you have to do is to click save and you will be good to go, right now we have this, uh, this product includes a physical component, uh, it is not a physical or will as fulfilled in admin until you fulfill the physical component, right here it is a uh, create a download link, you can create a download link, you can copy the link and make it at everything that you want, for example, let's see this download link, well, well, like this, you can see right here, this is the download link, you can download it right here and you are good to go, that was very simple, and uh, now you can see right here the product, this is the product, this is the physical product, you can put the fulfill, you can uh, put the apply right here automatically, send files manually, send files, it is up to you, and it is good to go right here. You have set up the digital product, when you go to product, you can see here we have uh, the digital product. That was all for today's video, thank you guys for watching, I hope that you have enjoyed the content and hope to see you on the next one.